What's up, everybody? I'm Jay Kid, and this is Splash Bros Morning Show. Time to punch a bitch voice in the dick. So the bitch voice was winning a lot last week. I think I woke up at 3:30 once or twice throughout the whole week, and today I woke up and I was tired, and I was like, "Fuck, I'm just gonna sleep in." And then I was like, "You little bitch, you better get the fuck up. This is fucking bullshit. So you're gonna break your habit." It's so much easier to break a habit than it is to build one. So, I got my ass up, got in the shower, brushed my teeth, flossed, all that good stuff. And I'm not going to let that habit break. It's 3.30. That's the time we wake up. If I have to start hiding my phone again, I damn well will. <laughs> I damn well will. It took me a minute to figure out what I was going to say. But, yeah, I'm a little out of it. I got to get back into the groove fucked up taking a week off is so stupid i don't like taking a day off so the whole week fucked me up basically but we're back we're getting into it it's gonna suck today tomorrow will be easier the next day will be easier and then it'll be right back to it so we're good on that aspect everything should be fine i got today's episode going it is monday let me know what you guys got going on when you guys go back to work what your plans are, how your weekend was, drop a comment, hit that like button, hit subscribe, all that good stuff, and I would appreciate it, it helps the channel out, but let me know if, if you guys had a hard week last week, maybe it wasn't just me, but I don't know, it, it was hard yet last week, sometimes I feel like I'm going up, 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 and then boom, boom, I crash, sometimes it lasts a little longer, sometimes... Well, usually it lasts a little longer. This this time I was able to knock it out within a couple days to a week. But, I don't know. Sometimes I just run my body way too hard. Ooh, sorry, guys. Like I said, I'm fucking tired today. That bitch voice is like, it's okay, let's go back to sleep. After you finish your video, we can go back to sleep until your son wakes up and it's school time. You've got to you've got to record a music video late tonight and you're gonna be so tired. So so let's just go back to sleep just for a little bit. And I'm like, no bitch voice, we can't go to sleep for a little bit. We can't do it. Cause then I'm gonna go to sleep for a little bit tomorrow, and then I'm fucked. And then I'm fucked. I can't break this habit. I enjoy doing this. I'm starting to feel a little more awake now that I'm doing this. But, dude, just in my head, like, all through here, I just feel exhausted. I don't know why. <sighs> but, it sucks. Oh, fuck. I almost punched myself in the face with my boxing glove. But, yeah. It's been... Other than that, it's been good. I got a music video to do tonight with uh, Alexander the Great. That should be pretty dope. And then... You got a lot of editing to do. I did end up finding the Colorado cleanup video, so I got to put that up. I got to figure out when we're doing April's because it doesn't seem like we're going to do it anytime in the beginning of the month. I feel like if we aim towards the end, it might be better. Just do April's and then May's right after. So that's the plan. I'm still trying to keep up on everything. Still got to do Get Fit Fat Kid. We did one episode, but then it got cold as fuck, and I don't have a gym, so. So we're going to start that again. I fucked up, and I did a three-day fast. Actually, I didn't even do a full three days. I did, like, 30-some hours. And so my belly's not where it was. It's just got a little baby pooch now. So I got to. I don't know. I'm still going to keep Get Fit Fat Kid. I'm not going to get fat again. I did that last time, and it sucked. I don't like being fat. I like being fit. I have no chest anymore. It's driving me nuts. I feel like my arms are dropping. So that'll be the goal. I think we might start that today. We'll do maybe today. I've got a lot to do today. If not today, we'll start it this week, and then we're going to go daily for 90 days at least. Maybe more. But I want to do at least 90 days so we can see our transformation. Everybody can comment. Tell me what their what their goal is. 
tell me how they're doing, how they're proceeding. Um, let me know if they need any, if you guys need any help with like diet plans, things like that. I'm vegetarian, so mine will be a little different, but I can definitely help. But that's the whole plan. To start start a channel to where it's entertaining. It's got a bunch of good shows. It's got cartoons. Um, it's got TV shows, movies, but it's also got shit that helps people. We'll have the Get Fit Fat Kid. We got the morning show, which hopefully, well, not hopefully, we'll get to the point where we can take calls. We can do things like that. Maybe I'll start calling people at 3 a.m. and fucking with them. I mean might as well call up Mezzin, wake his bitch ass up be like yo bro wake your bitch ass up nah shout out to my boy Mezzin. <clears throat> but yeah hit some friends up call them early as fuck shit a lot of them probably are partying anyway so I don't know we'll see where we get with this this is episode 20 which is cool we're killing it. Sorry, guys. I'm fucking exhausted. Oh, shit, man. I am beat today. I might just call this one short. Be happy we got it out. I don't know, though, because I might fall asleep. I'm trying to avoid falling asleep, but I feel like it might happen today. I've got to be up all night, so I don't know. I feel like it's smarter to sleep, but we'll see. As long as I get this done and uploaded, I might be able to take like a little power nap. Just because the music video doesn't even start until like 5 o'clock. So that'll go probably until 10 or 11. And then I gotta go... I gotta go do some stuff after that. Go meet up with, with some someone. You know, do all that fun stuff. And then, yeah, hopefully, ah, <laughs> my boxing glove from I Love Kickboxing, fucking place is cool as fuck, so if you're in Greeley and you want to kickbox, get some of the hardest cardio you've ever had in your entire life, I Love Kickboxing, bam, place is dope, holy shit, I went there. I hadn't worked out for, I think, a month. It was right after I got super swole and I was, like, all muscle. But I, I took a month off. And I went there. And holy shit. Within 20 minutes, I think, 30 minutes, I was I just had to stand still in the middle because I was going to throw up. I was like, don't throw up here. Don't, don't, don't throw up here. You can't go to the bathroom either. You got old ladies kicking the shit out of the bag and you're standing here like a little bitch about to throw up. You better swallow that shit. <laughs> Don't fucking do it. Don't do it. Oh, that shit was rough. Some of the hardest cardio I've ever done. I love kickboxing. Like, it's not really... I mean, I guess it does teach you how to punch a little bit and how to kick a little bit, but it's not really, like, training, training. But holy fuck, that cardio will fuck your world up. That is the best. I can't wait till all this shit's over and I can go back. Go do some boxing, do a little MMA, maybe start fighting a little bit. I don't know. I've been wanting to fight for a while, but shit like that I have a hard time spending my money on. <clears throat> if it doesn't have the potential to make me money, then I usually don't do it. I did one kickbox or I was in one kickboxing MMA thing. That place was like, I think 400 bucks a month. That shit was nuts. And it was like an hour and a half, two hours away from my house. So definitely not doing that one. There is a cool ass spot in Greeley. I don't remember what it's called. Um, I don't know. Something. Top Notch. That's what it is. There's a place called Top Notch in Greeley that's supposed to be badass. And it's only like 100 bucks a month. So... I think I'm going to start that once all this shit's over. Start fucking fighting. I'm about to be 30. So, I got to get fighting. I got to make my million this year like I said I would. I said I'd make it when I was 30. So, I'm giving myself until April of next year. But, I plan to do it by the end of this year. 
we'll see. Shit kind of slowed down a little bit, so April might be the perfect time just to cover for this, but I feel like I can still do it this year. We're still shooting for that for that six figures this month. I got a couple things in the works that should should do it. So we'll see. We'll see how that goes. This fucking corona fucked a lot of shit up, though. So I, it had me think. I think last week a lot of what why I didn't do shit was because I just got so focused on the on the on the Kona. I got so focused on the Kona. I dove really deep. I learned a lot of shit that we're not supposed to know about. And it just had me second guessing a lot of shit. Like, I remember saying, no matter what happens, I will make a million dollars. And then this shit happened and I started laughing and I was like, what if the dollar, if we just get rid of the dollar? Like, that's, that's the ultimate fuck you, like, comedic, just, uh, from the universe. <laughs> Holy fuck, it made me laugh so hard. If that happens, amazing, amazing joke. That's hilarious. If it doesn't, then we'll, we'll hit it. Either way, we're, ma we're gonna get rich this year. That's all there is to it. I'm gonna make enough money to where I can start my town. I can start giving back to all you beautiful people. Like I said, I want the money so I can help all of you. I don't give a shit about cars. I don't give a shit about houses. I don't give a shit. Like, I'm happy just doing this. Like, if I had a nice little studio, just a place to kick it, everybody around me's happy, everyone around me's well fed, then that's life. That's good. I can't think of anything better. Me being rich while everyone else struggles and I'm just some piece of shit CEO does not sound appealing sounds like fucking hell like fuck that I want to be rich so you all can be rich so we all can be rich like I said I want to hand someone 20 grand at Walmart that's my biggest goal struggling mom here's 20 grand that part makes me wonder though cuz you never know who you're handing money to. I could hand someone 20 grand and she could go ditch her kids for fucking three months. So, it might be, hey, what's up? Let me change your life. Let me buy you a car. Let me do all this shit. That's why I like Mr. Beast so much. He does everything that I've always wanted to do. I mean, he does it publicly. Eh, I don't, I don't want to do it publicly. I feel like that takes away. It's really cool because he's inspiring people so I love him for that I love all that shit but me personally that's not why I want to do it I don't want to like be like look at me look at it fuck that's not what I mean I don't mean that's what he's doing but that's not how I want to be <laughs> I'm not trying to talk down on him I just don't want to be like look at me look at what I do it makes you, you feel good and shit but that's why I'm doing it to help people to feel good not to get views I mean, it's awesome that that gets views, but that's not what I'm at. So, that's my goal. Let's get rich. Let's get everyone else rich. Let's start a mecca. Free school, free food, free everything. We're all just living, doing what we love, helping each other progress. It'd be a beautiful thing. It's going to be a beautiful thing. So, with all that said, I think I'm going to end this. I'm fading out. I'm fading out fast. I don't know why, but I'm Jay Kidd. This is The Morning Show, episode 20. Thank you all. Peace.